Hi, I'm Kian, and today uh, I'm back with one integral from uh, the MIT 2020 uh, Integration B uh, qualifying exam. So in this uh, example, we have the integral of natural log of x squared plus 1. So first of all, like looking at it, you might think of a u substitution, but that won't work because if you let u to be equal to uh, the inside, we get du b 2x and we'll make the integral much more complicated than it is now. So I'm going to use uh, integration by parts, also known as di method. I'm going to show you how I calculate it. So we write di, d stands for derivative, i stands for integration. There is the same as integration by parts, but has a different notation. So I'm going to differentiate, actually, let me write it here. I'm going to differentiate natural log of x squared plus 1. Natural log of x squared plus 1, and I'm going to integrate 1, because 1 multiplied by any quantity is itself. Integrating 1 is uh, fairly easy. You just get x. Differentiating natural log of x squared plus 1, we get uh, 1 over uh, x squared plus 1. And then we should use a chain rule uh, to multiply by uh, the derivative of inside. The derivative inside is actually 2x, so let me write 2x at the top to make it easier. Okay, so now what should we do? The first part of the answer to this integral is the product of two, these two cross terms. So uh, the first part of the answer will be x times ln of x squared plus 1. And then we should subtract uh, by the integral of the product of these two bottom terms. Why subtract? Because there is a negative sign. So we should actually integrate the product. 2x times x is 2x squared. And then um, over x squared plus 1. So... How do we integrate this? Integrate this. So the way we integrate it is actually um, an easy way. So the way we integrate it is that we can, first of all, because we want to make the uh, integral easier, we can take out this constant. So I'm going to use another color. I'm going to take out this constant. So I'm going to write this integral as 2 times the integral of x squared over x squared plus 1 and then dx. So we see that the numerator and denominator are kind of similar. Maybe we can like add and subtract 1. So we can add and then we can subtract 1 here. So actually I can split the fractions now and I can write this as the integral x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 1 is just 1. And then minus 1 over x squared plus 1. And then dx. So integrating 1, we get x. And then integrating uh, 1 uh, over x squared plus 1, we get uh, inverse tangent of x or arc tan so for our final answer I'm gonna write it here with a different color so I'm gonna write it here for our final answer we get x times ln of x squared plus 1 And then we have a minus 2. When we distribute it, we get minus 2x and then plus 2 times inverse tangent of x. And then we have a plus c at the end. 
So we are done with this integral. Um, maybe we can do one more. Yes, I have one more integral I can to show you. This is also from the MIT 2020 Integration B Qualifying Exam. We have integral of natural log of um, 2x over x times natural log of x. So for this question, I'm going to split the fraction because we can write this as natural log of 2 plus um, natural log of x. I can write this as the integral of natural um, log of 2 and then over x times natural log of x and then plus natural log of x. over um, x times natural log of x and then dx. So for the first integral, we can perform a u substitution. We let u to be equal to ln x and then du is 1 over x dx. So we know that dx is x times du. So now when we uh, actually uh, make this integral to the um, um, u variable, we can see that there's a cancellation. x here cancels. So actually for this integral, which I'm going to write it here, we just get the integral of natural log of 2 and then over, because the x cancels, we're just left off with natural log of x, which is u, and then du. Okay, so because natural log of 2 is a constant, I can take it outside of this. So when we integrate 1 over u, we just get natural log of u. So for this integral, we just get natural log of 2 times natural log of u, and u is natural log of x. So this is natural log of natural log of x. And then plus, uh, and now for uh, this integral, for this integral, we can also um, perform a, um, uh, we don't need uh, actually to perform u substitution because we see that natural log of x and natural log of x here cancel. So we're just left off with the integral. Um, so let me not add the plus c here. Uh, so we have, and then we have plus. So the integral of this, I'm going to write it here. We see that natural log of x cancels with natural log of x. So actually, integral of 1 over x is just natural log of x. And then we have a plus C at the end. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and watch my previous.